Игорь Ильич, будьте любезны. Руки. It is equally appropriate to ask the question, what if we failed to act and allow Saddam Hussein to continue to flout the UN resolutions, uh, to continue to play hide and seek with inspectors, to continue to uh, frustrate their efforts to determine uh, the volume and amounts of chemical weapons uh, he has in his uh, stocks and his capacity to deliver them. Now that we have started or already. Good evening. Good evening. Let me uh, state it very clearly. Uh, his statement, which was uh, very uh, direct and candid, came as no surprise to me. And I want uh, everyone to understand that I had the full opportunity to express my own thoughts uh, in response. And achieve the goal of fulfilling the resolution of the Soviet Union of Security and Political and Diplomatic Measures. There was a fundamental agreement that Saddam Hussein must uh, obey and fulfill all of the UNSCOM uh, resolutions, the Security Council resolutions. There is no disagreement on that whatsoever, even though there remains a disagreement uh, on how we achieve that end. We categorically deny that Russia ever supplied any equipment that would be a violation of the existing sanctions of the United Nations or that could be used to produce any kind of prohibited material.